We got a lot of time until then. So it turns out the cactus I bought at the 100 yen store was fake this whole time. No wonder it didn't weather. And here I thought I was taking such great care of it. Isn't the purpose of a cactus that you don't have to take care of it though? No way. Oh my god, that's hilarious. You put so much effort into watering it too. If you want a real plant, get one from a home center or, you know, an actual flower shop. Yeah, I think I'll buy one from the flower shop on Port Island. Oh, I need to decorate my shelves. I hear they've been selling seedlings for home gardening lately. Oh, oh seeds for the garden on the roof. Okay. <laughs> Throws the baby. Exactly. The Florida at Port Island station seems to be selling seedlings for home gardens. I might find new seedlings there. I should check it out. What's in stock every now and then. Her spell has rang. I guess I should check out that store and see what's there. Class is ended for today, okay. Um, let us see. Today is the 27th. I have written down to hang out with Hidetoshi. We have so many people! Okay. So many people! Is this student council? It is. Okay. Spend time with the uh, with our stuck up our stuck up dude. All right, Otagiri, I'm counting on you for both our sakes. Deal with this uniform issue. <laughs> at least he shapes up at the end, though. Oh. Hey, Otagiri. What was that about? What did he mean by for both our sakes? Blackmail! He just wants to create a better school environment, so he simply asked a student fit for the job. Oh, damn, you think highly of yourself, bro? Just like how the okay, what is actually the shape of those desks? They got little, like, crevices in them. What? You can't decide something like that without talking to the president first. Um, okay, so I need to choose... What happened? Someone found a cigarette butt in the boys' bathroom. And that teacher wants the disciplinary committee to look into whose it was. Someone has broken school rules. It's only natural that I'm involved in finding and holding the transgressor accountable. That is a big, uh, big deal. Two choices. Either help I'm have to cut back gameplay froze on me. Oh, shoot. And prove you can't. Oh. Let's see. My stream looks okay, though. Oh, no. I hope your Wi Fi is okay. Your connection. People like you and me have to deal with a lot of crap around here, don't we? Oh, damn. I'm the only person he thinks highly of. You acting like a cop? Kind of. I mean, that's kind of what um, the steering council does in Japan. We saw with, like, um,. Um, Toshiro and, um, Eri in, uh, Persona 5 Tactica, they were also doing the same thing. Uh, I- I know that the student council plays a much bigger role in Japan than it does in- than, like, the ASB in high school in, like, America. <laughs> I feel like we're becoming better friends. Stream is fine for you? It's probably just, uh, the connection for Lonnie. Well then, I'll be excusing myself. Bow, chicka, bow, hey, bow, chicka, bow, bow. Me, you kiss ass. Yeah, tell him. <laughs> he is a kiss ass. I need water. Student council members shouldn't be fighting like this, should they? I better go tell the president. Mitsu deals with enough of crap. My work, my work is done here, so I'll head home. <laughs> We're just like peace. Accepted. Oh, that's it. Okay. Let us go. We're gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna be focusing on my charm and my courage for a little bit. For night time. So I'm gonna work at the cafe. We also get money as well as stats. Work part time. I sweated it out while working part time as a waiter. 
Oh my god, her bag was all blurry. Customer called me over and praised my service. Let's go. I dealt with housewives come. Oh, we've had this one before. Complaining that the coffee doesn't actually make their husbands horny. All right, give me those stat increases. We're getting there. Yeah, I know we had to reconnect. Haha, <laughs> he a booty kisser. <laughs> Alright, 28th. Sup, dude? So, what do you think? Of what? Yeah. About that girl, Fuka Yamagishi. I have lost hope that she'll join our team. Oh, the girl that's always on the rooftop? I guess I should speak to her. Dude, I've actually seen her around. And yeah, she does look kind of frail, but that just makes me want to be strong enough for the two of us. You, Junpei, are very desperate. Very, very desperate, sir. <laughs> oh, this guy, Mr. Ono. Let's see, today I'll be covering the Kofun period in our history. I don't know, though. Do any of you think this stuff's relevant? I mean, I could slap together some clay statues that look a lot better than theirs did. I can't wait until we get to the Sengoku era. It's so much more exciting. Speaking of the Sengoku era, there was this one general they called the Warhawk of the Battlefield. That's a very desperate boy. Looks like this turned into another Sengoku lecture. He loves his Sengoku era. I'm feeling sleepy, but our stats are not max, so we're gonna stay awake. Samurai so... helmet teacher taking it to the next level. He, all the teachers at this school are unhinged and they don't give a, they actually don't care about what they're teaching about. Isn't that, it's so funny. They either don't care about what they're teaching about, they hate their job, or they would rather be teaching something else, or they're so invested in what they're teaching that they forget to actually teach it. <laughs> And that's how the period came to be known as the Sengoku era. Huh? You want to hear more about the Kofun period? Well, if you insist, uh, go look up the Kitora tomb. Kitor Kitora tomb in Nara. It's really famous. I focus myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. Goodness. Goodness, sir. All these teachers. And all the students are just like, it's fine. As long as it- as long as it makes our learning material easier, the teachers can say whatever they want. <laughs> okay, today is the 28th. Um, we are going to hang out with Kenji because I'm neglecting him. I've- I've neglected him for too long. And we get to hear about the teacher that he has a crush on. Okay, and I brought Jack Frost with me. Alright. Gotta be at you know where. You say that like like we're not supposed to be here at a ramen shop after school. Despite its simple appearance, the soup has a complex flavor that's enhanced by the noodles. I really want ramen now. It is actually pretty nice weather for some ramen. It's nice and nice and uh chill outside. It's a cozy day. Definitely not ramen, definitely not school, because he loves school, because he likes to see the teacher, so it has to be life. life. Dude, you watch too much reality TV. Well, I mean, life is a problem. <laughs> but I guess, yeah, you could say I'm sick of life. I mean, I get up, go to school, sit through lame-ass lectures, eat, watch TV, and go to bed. What about your homework? Okay, that settles it. I'm gonna get myself a girlfriend. Right now. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. I have no faith in you. Sounds impossible, but we have to be we have to be a homie. What a cool thing to say. Soon I'll have a girlfriend and be just as cool as you. But Makoto doesn't have a girlfriend. Alright, I think I'm gonna pull the trigger on my secret plan. I told you about the teacher, right? I'm gonna ask her out and get her to fall in love with me. Oh, sir. Oh, you delusional young man. She likes me. <laughs> you heard of her? She teaches third year ethics. We get along pretty well. She's not mainstream beautiful, but she's really pretty. 
She's got these cute little eyes, a sexy body. Oh, God. Uh, don't tell anyone about this, okay? You're the only one who knows. And uh, this man that's uh, sitting behind us, <laughs> who's clearly listening to our conversation. Tomochika told me more about this plan. I feel like our relationship is growing stronger. There's only rank three, and this dude's spilling his secrets to us. Dude, I'm getting so psyched. Let's cook up a plan of attack. Tomochika and I chatted on the walk home. Goodness. Oh, Kenji. Oh, Kenji. At least have something of yourself to offer <laughs> so that she'll fall in love with you. Oh, I keep forgetting to buy sodas. It's strange. The number of apathy syndrome victims seems to be on the rise again. Evidently, the prior decline was only temporary. Uh -huh. If that's the case, then what's the point of fighting? No. If we do nothing, then everyone will eventually join the lost. Our efforts have prevented the crisis from escalating to that point. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you're right. I'd hate to see what the city would be like if we couldn't use our personas. I said this before you forget again. I know. The SP sodas. I need them. The very important SP sodas. I've definitely missed out on a few. Oh my god. What are you boys doing? Mad bulls. And then I'll have to buy some at the vending machine at, s at the mall. We're saving the city, right, Sonata-san? Yeah. Well, yeah. Why well, state the obvious? Hmm. Well, because it doesn't really feel like it. It'd just be nice if we could get some kind of thank you. From the ladies, at least. <laughs> oh, Junpei. Hmm. Junpei and Kenji can spend hours just talking about women. Our efforts probably won't be appreciated by the people in town. But if we don't fight, then the city will eventually be overrun with the lost. That's why we need to enjoy the peace and quiet whenever we find it. That's the result of our hard work. Make sure you don't forget that. Of course, of course. Alright, let us, um... Today is the 28th. Let's go to the strip mall. And buy some sodas and also eat more seafood. Fill up... Fill up Makoto with delicious expensive food. Okay, buy some SP drinks. Fountain Dew! Oh, wait, have I bought these other drinks? I have not. I need them for, uh... Elizabeth. Alright, seafood again. Soon, Makoto will be sick of seafood. Once I rank up his academic stats, he's gonna hate seafood. <laughs> Me. Omega threes. Take your fish oils, everybody. Above average. <laughs> Alright, we're almost in June. Let's go. I think I might do Tartarus today. We'll see. I heard from a younger guy in my club yesterday that a second year is getting bullied. Oh, it's Fuka, that's right. That's crazy! Which second year? I don't know. All I heard is that it's pretty serious. I thought our school was peaceful, but I guess stuff like that still happens here. Actually, let's go see if we can sneak a peek at Fuka. Seems like someone in the same grade as me is getting bullied. It's Fuka! Let's go say hi to her. After class, I guess. Oh, not this guy. I hate even voicing him. <laughs> Quiet down, class. It's time to begin today's lecture. Progre... Progredio? Oh, wait. Is this Latin? I can't speak Latin. I'm changing today's lecture to another integrated learning one since Mr. Ekoda left early today. He's claimed he wasn't feeling well. Looks fine enough to me, though. Quick word of caution. Make sure you know what you're eating before you take a bite. Oh, I can't believe I have to stay awake through this guy's class. All he does is yap, 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 yap. I've covered the basics of learning magic last time. So today I'll go a bit deeper into me me meditation. 
first, let's review the ways that magicians will meditate. To heighten the creative impulse, the source of all your magical power, observe a real world object carefully, then recreate it in your mind down to the last tiny detail. That's the Western standard of meditation, but I'd like to talk about the Eastern style as well. Meditation was originally refined in the East, and modern magicians adapted Eastern meditation for their own original style. You'll find the right posture, take a deep breath in and out, and calm your mind. That's the basic practice of the Eastern style. It doesn't take much to practice meditation either. All you need is some free time in a relatively calm environment. It doesn't take long, but you should give yourself at least 15 minutes for a proper session. Now for the specifics. First, your posture. Just take a position that you can find comfortable. Sitting cross-legged is good enough for most, but you can try the full lotus position, too. It's sometimes called Kekafuza. <coughs> you can even meditate while sitting in a chair. Any position works as long as it's comfortable. Once your breathing is relaxed, close you or cover your eyes and let the rest of your body relax too. Do I have permission to skip this guy's dialogue the next time he's teaching? <laughs> now that you've prepared yourself physically, you'll focus next on your mind and soul. Imagine a symbol. Some symbol image, perhaps a large tree or the moon. It could even be the god of your own faith if you'd like. However, do not force yourself to fully empty your mind. That's actually a common misconception. Most people aren't even capable of it, but succeeding is especially dangerous. You run the risk of losing all control of yourself. Goodness. Do I, do I actually have permission to skip his dialogue next time? <laughs> that is to say. So what have we learned? Meditation can be aided through iconography. Iconography? Yeah. Rather than forcing an empty mind. Even Christian prayer can reach a level of meditation if practiced fervently enough. Although in that case, the imagined symbol is present for a reason other than meditational aid. It can be dangerous to plumb the depths of your consciousness. But by keeping a clear symbol in mind, you avoid teetering over the edge and plunging into the darkness. Go ahead and try meditating tonight, if you'd like. Alright, that's it for today. I forced myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. I forced myself to voice act the whole thing. <laughs> but at least we get something out of it. We get academics. Alright, let's go take a peep at Fuka and see how she's doing with her... her bullying situation, sadly. Oh, I guess Yukari's on it. <sighs> what a workout. I gotta teach those first years how to clean up properly. <laughs> Then I pretended to take a picture with my cell phone. Then she totally freaked out and started crying. Oh, this girl's a new voice actor. It was like we caught her red-handed or something. You should have seen the look on her face. It was priceless. It was priceless. Wow, that's pathetic. <laughs> I've never laughed so hard in all my life. <laughs> They're making fun of someone? Bullies. Say it louder, Yukari! Huh? Did you hear... a voice? It's... calling me. Huh? What voice? I don't hear anything. Oh. Uh, Maki? What's going on? Oh, she's got the syndrome. Okay? Ooh. All right. Finally gone. Time to check up on Fuka. Stand girls like I agree, Yukari. Class is ended for today. All right, let's go to the. Oh my God, there's so many people that want to hang out with me. Okay. Uh, where's the rooftop? Oh, can't go to the rooftop. Okay, we have to walk out ourselves. Okay. Uh, I just want to take a peek at Fuka, see what she's up to, and then we're gonna come back in, and then we're gonna. 
hang out with Kenji today. Oh, okay, fine this way. <laughs> Bebe! We're gonna hang out with Bebe soon. I, I want to hear his French voice actor. Fuka, oh, Fuka's not up here. Oh, well then. <laughs> Never mind, we go back to the classroom. Hey, yo. Okay, we're hanging out. Oh, no, I went downstairs. I'll be. Oh, God. Okay, this way. Back to the classroom. Kenji, are you happy? I'm giving you all this attention after ignoring you for an entire month. You should be honored, sir. Did you ask out your teacher? Oh, yeah, totally random. But have you ever heard of the Gourmet King? Apparently, there's a foodie around here who's a cut above the rest. They say he's a student at our school. Wouldn't it be cool if he told us the best places to eat? I'd totally take a date there. Oh, yeah. I heard he's really into sandwiches now, so you could probably catch him eating one in town. Oh, is this Nozomi? Is this the start to the to Nozomi social link? My least favorite social link? <laughs> Tabachika gave me a lead on the Gourmet King. Oh, yeah, it's definitely him. Oh, uh, by the way, I actually wanted to talk to you for a sec. Uh, don't worry, it won't take long. Yes, we will spend time with you. I guess I gotta tell you this someday. Uh, come on, let's head to the courtyard downstairs. Oh my god, he's gonna confess to me in the courtyard, hey, everyone! Coming, man. <laughs> you mind waiting here for a sec? Okay, listen. Don't freak out. Did you ask her out? I'm gonna go ask Miss Kano out. Like, right now! <laughs> Good luck, sir. Uh, that's what I have to say. Good luck, sir. I, I I would love to tell him don't do it, but we have to be on his side. We have to be we have to be a supporter for him. That's what he wants to hear. Thanks, man. Time to go get myself a girlfriend. All right, this is it. Here I go. Oh God. <laughs> ah, cringe. Dude, dude, dude. Oh man, listen to this. She said yes. I can't believe it. This uh. is crazy. Can't believe she Just says yes. To ask her out, but then she asked me if I wanted a private lesson. Oh, I forgot that he's also stupid. Oh wait. <laughs> oh my god, it's been so long since I played the mail route. I forget he's stupid. <laughs> for real, dude. I owe you. I owe you big time for hearing me out. Well, she said yes. Okay, but here's the thing. He wanted to ask her out. She thinks, oh, okay, so a student is coming to me, seemingly wants wants to spend time. He needs help with his studies. That's what Miss Kano's thinking. She said, here, we can hold a private study session if you if you need extra time with your teacher. That's definitely what she's thinking. It sounds like Tomachika's secret plan went well. He's, he's basically taking it, taking her intentions the wrong way. I feel like our relationship is stronger. A rank four with the magician. I'm about to head over to her house. Oh man, I'm not ready for this. I shouldn't expect anything too crazy from the get-go, right? But again, she is an adult. So... Oh, forgot you were there. Sorry, but I got a jet. I actually can't 100% remember how this socially goes, but I'm pretty sure it goes that he read the whole thing incorrectly. Like, he thought that she was into him, but she's like, um, sir, you're my student. I'm just trying to help you get better at your at your grades. <laughs> at least that's how I think it went. It's been like four years since I've played the mail route, so I can't quite remember. What's up, dude? What's up, Junpei? Okay, tonight, um, we will... Let's see, did the sodas refill? No. Where's Akihiko? I didn't see him. Okay, he's not in his room. Um, I did look ahead to see, like, um, when, when do I unlock Akihiko's new social link? And I said it should, uh, his social link won't be unlocked today, but there should 
be something available with him. Where is he? Did I just miss him? Or is he just not here? Oh, there we go. He texted me. I was like, where are you, bro? Sorry for the sudden invite, but I'm thinking about getting something to eat right now. Do you want to join me? I'm in front of Iwatonai Station. Yeah, let's go. Because uh, when this, like, linked episode thing popped up, I quickly, like, looked it up. And I was like, um, this is new. I don't know what to do with this. What, uh, where, when should I keep out for it? And it says I should be able to hang out with Akihiko today. Yeah, here we go. Oh, there's a vending machine. We gotta buy. Gotta buy drinks. Gotta buy drinks first. Mad bulls. And then I already have one of each of these. Oh my god. <laughs> this guy with a huge hunch in front. Yo, Yuki. Did you see my text message? Wanna go grab a bite? Sonata has invited me to join in. This might be a good opportunity to get to know him better. Okay, but d does this star his social link? I doubt it though, but like... Does he even have a social link in this game? Because he doesn't he doesn't originally have one in the mail route. But they've added this linked episode thing. Yes. Great, let's go. I've gotten a lot of my edge back since I've been able to focus on my training. I've been meaning to thank you for that. You've really stepped up as our leader. So tonight's on me. You've got enough responsibility as it is. Um, I don't think it matters what I choose. Cause I'm starving and barely getting by. I can handle it. I'm a tough guy. <laughs> you really are something else. I knew I had a good feeling about you. Just don't push yourself too hard. Things will get easier with experience. And if you need anything, let me know. I'll do whatever I can to help. Uh, excuse me. Oh no, fangirl. Fans? <laughs> oh my god. I've never seen anyone fangirl over their classmates, but... <laughs> in IRL. But who knows? I don't know what Japan's like. I kept hearing rumors that you were injured. Uh, are you okay now? Do you need any help? Is there anything I can bring you? Oh, he's gonna hate that. Don't do it, girls. He's gonna hate that. Stop. Maybe? <laughs> the adults are just like, who? What's this commotion? Let's go. Wait, just fangirls, no big deal. I've had this problem at school, but I didn't think it happened out here too. It's probably because of those interviews. Or the rumors online. I've gotten all kinds of attention as I've kept up my winning streak. Suffering from success, sir. <laughs> um, I'm jealous. Let's say I'm jealous. I want to see what he says. <laughs> I've heard Junpei say that. Oh no, don't put me on the same level as Junpei. Oh, I'm never saying that ever again. <laughs> well, I appreciate their support, but I don't have time for them right now. All I want to be as strong as I can. I want to train hard and feel real pride in my strength. But all I ever seem to get is more trouble. Alright, looks like they've given up. Let's head out to eat. For real this It looks like we just ran to the corner, if anything. <laughs> yes, we need the beef bowls. I'm so hungry. I haven't eaten at all today. I know a place that'd be perfect for us, girl. Oh, it's the same girls. Please, just leave us alone. We're not interested. One drink. That's all we're asking. Come on. It'll be fun. We said no, okay? Oh, God. He definitely should help them, but they're also going to become even bigger fangirls of him. Leave them alone. You don't want the police to get involved, do you? Huh? 
Who the hell are you? What? You want to call the cops? Quit trying to act like a big man, you little punk. Fight. Yeah, time for you to piss off. <laughs> fight. He's got boxing experience. He knows how to fight. You piece of... Hold up. You got some slick moves. I bet you know how to fight. Am I right? So what if I do? How about you and I go a few rounds? If you ain't too busy, spot around back. Whenever I see guys who think they're hot shit, all I want to do is put them in their place. I bet a lot of people call you a tough guy. So how about we put it to the... I test? think you need an ego. Someone to crash your ego, but if I, the, the way you're proposing ain't, ain't the right way. told you nothing but trouble stay here i'll be done no don't do it akiko what you think you're gonna beat me just like that but don't worry i won't go all out against an amateur it's got to be a fair fight he's so confident too <laughs> goodness <laughs> hey over there break it up uh, let's beat it I told you, officer. They were the ones antagonizing us. And I told you we'll hear all about it down at the station. You're high school students, aren't you? We'll need your contact information. Neither of us have parents. parents no. This. If I could butt in. Oh, yes. The officer who's on our side. And Kurosawa-san. I'll handle these two. I've already cleared it with the brass. They really think a bunch of high school students would go around picking fights with thugs? That actually a thing? It wasn't our fault that was a close call. It wasn't our fault, bro. We just wanted to help some girls out. We get a report from two ladies saying you were attacked by a group of punks. Oh. They wanted to test my strength. I was just giving them what they wanted. <laughs> Akiko, don't be like that. In the middle of a public street, you really need to think things through. He, his personality is a little bit different from the original, I think. Well, we Listen, technically an of the law. didn't get the scene in the original game, so maybe it could have been like this the whole time. This is gonna have to deal with me. As you can see, your friend here is a bit of a hothead. I know it won't be easy, but try and keep an eye on him, would you? Those are some bold words, but thanks. <laughs> my arm's healed, and we've got way more dependable people now. There's no better time to test my strength. Especially now that we have someone like you. We really lucked out on that one. So I'm going to keep honing my skills. That way, I can put down anyone I face with my own two hands. <laughs> you really haven't changed at all. In any case, don't get in over your heads. I have a hunch the guys you ran into were from a gang that's been active around here recently. A gang? Just be careful. You don't want can this be a side quest that we can take Once care of? On it, you'll never get off. All right, it's late. If only, you know what I really enjoyed about Persona 5? Was that you can take uh, like side requests from the meta, what was it called? The phantom site, the fan site, or something like that, and then you can solve real world problems. I liked that. I know that's probably not going to be a thing in this game, but that would be cool. Like we can, we can um, steal the hearts of these thugs, but uh, the concept of take your heart is not a thing in this game. But th th those were always really fun side quests to see, like what so all the problems happening in the real world on the side. Stop interruptions all night. <sighs> Gross, right though. We should probably head home. Sorry about this. Now, we came outside just to get in trouble twice. I'm gonna do some jogging on the way. The back. peoples. You wanna join? Yeah. Why not? Good answer. It's dark, so watch out for cars. I'm gonna run ahead. You just follow at your own pace. He's really underestimating us. Damn. <laughs> I ran back to the dorm.
I feel like my stamina has improved after running that long of a distance. Increased by five, let's go. All right, the 30th, we're almost in June. I can hear people talking. It's these two girls all the time. Hey, have you heard about that second year? Oh yeah, the one they found lying in front of the school gate this morning, right? Hopefully she just ran away from home, but I feel like this is the start of something big. Goodness. Yeah, there might be reports and camera crews and stuff. I'd rather not deal with that. Hey, did you hear about that girl in 2E? The bullying! I heard they have no idea what happened. Luca. Oh my god, isn't it so bizarre? Man, everyone's talking about it. People sure got a lot of time. Well, I mean, hands. bullying is no no You're joke, bro. Oh, jeez. Um, I'm not gonna say I'm not interested because that's straight up bad. The girl from 2E went missing while she was out late last night. And this morning, I found Oh, it's not is it that uh it? the girl who's friends with um the bully? The one that was uh, having weird symptoms when they were gossiping? Nobody knows what happened. And supposedly, she's still unconscious. Morning! Yo, Yukata! Man, this is a tough case. Even for Junpei Yori, Ace Detective. <laughs> Ace Detective? You're so dumb. More like stupe. Hey, oh, there we go. She finally says stupe. Where'd that come from? Actually, now that I think about it, I haven't seen you all morning. Where you been? I was talking to the teacher. And that girl they found? I saw her yesterday on my way back from practice. She seemed just fine then. Huh. The plot thickens. The plot thickens. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> this is real life. This ain't no game. <laughs> Not quite literally. Class is ended for today. All right. Well, today, uh, yesterday, Kenji told us about Nozomi. Um, so let's go out and find him and see if we can start his social link. Um, I think I, if I remember correctly, I think he hangs out at the Halloween Mall. Seems like there is something here. Um, where is he? He was always be standing off to the side in the regular game. But where is he here? Unless he's not here. Oh wait, no, he's behind. Okay, behind this girl. I couldn't see for a second. Um, okay. Eventually, I'm gonna need a moon person. Oh, I do have a moon persona. Sweet. Okay. Oh god. What? What? Don't look at me while I'm eating. You're making me feel self-conscious. Can't savor the flavor of my gourmet sandwich. Only available for a limited time with you here. Looks like... Oh, I do have enough charm. Perfect. What do you want? Uh, what you eating, sir? Oh, you're curious. Do you fancy yourself a gourmet? Is that even possible? An unrefined guy like you? I think not. You'll have to prove it. You can pass my gourmet quiz, then I'll believe you. Hmm, what should I ask? I don't want to make it too difficult. Give me some time to think. Phew, what a sandwich. Now the quiz begins. The first question is a freebie. What's the most popular drink at the cafe over there? Well, it has to be the Fremont coffee because they always advertise it. Correct. Here's question number two. What color skirt does Azi Azuki Arai's mascot Azuki chan wear? Huh? I don't know, it's probably red. Seems like a common skirt color. Oh, there we go. Hmm, you're pretty good. Question three What item is on the secret menu at Hagakure? Okay, I actually know this one. This one's the Hagakure bowl. And they've already mentioned it in the game, too, that that's the secret menu. I'm impressed. You seem to have some knowledge about food. 
but it pales in comparison to mine. Why don't you bring me something I've never eaten before? I'd have to be quite the odd morsel to fit that bill, though. If you succeed, then I'll accept you as a fellow gourmet. Okay, so we literally have to give him an odd morsel, which is an item that you can pick up in Tartarus. Ugh, this is awful. But I'm impressed. I haven't tasted something like that in all my life. You're not so bad. It seems like he's taking an interest in me. Should I hang with him for the day? And yes, we will spend time with him. We go to the same school, right? One look at your uniforms, all I need to know. He was my least favorite social link in Portable. So, and it's so, so far it seems like everyone's social links are turning out to be exactly the same. So I guess, um, I guess I probably won't like him any, any, any more <laughs> than I did originally. you this right off the bat, but... Would you mind not standing so close to me? You're too thin and too cool! If people start thinking we're best friends or something, I'm gonna end up as the uncool one! Well, he admits it. <laughs> there you are. I thought your voice sounded familiar. You know what I'm here for. Now hand it over. You gonna threaten this kid? Whoa! Not you! Uh, help! Uh, emergency! Uh, hey! You! Uh, Truck. Uh, I mean the uh, uh... <laughs> Yes, right. Good thing. The police de uh, department's right behind us. Scene, all right. People are looking at me funny. I've got some business to take care of now, but you, you're no Zomi Suemitsu Kun, aren't you? I did my homework. See, you about a high school student. That easy, right? I suggest you reconsider things. You're creepy, man. My poor heart! I think it dropped into my coin purse for a minute there. My name is Nozomi Suimitsu. By the way, may I just say that you have a- Oh shoot, I did not mean to skip that. Oh, This guy sounds like Monokuma. <laughs> By the way, may I just say that you have a one- Hard for someone so slim. Su Suimitsu, give me a hearty thanks. I become acquainted with Nozomi Su Suemitsu, the Gourmet King. He sounds either like Monokuma or like a slightly dweeby or ash from Fire Emblem. The Moon Arcana. Here we go. Rank one, Gourmet King. Whew, all that drama made me hungry. My stomach is definitely not amused. You want to tag along, friend? Shall I treat you to the finest dining? If so, you've come to the right place. For I am the king, the Gourmet King. That's right, Gourmet King 2009. Where was it 2010? Eh, whatever. And as the king, I know all the kingliest places for it. Uh, 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 my, my oh my god. <laughs> the sound effects. I think it's an emergency. Sorry, but I'll treat you uh, another time. He's a gourmet king, but even he seems to have colon or stomach issues. Started getting dark, so I went home. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know if I... Oh no! Am I gonna like this social link? Oh, welcome back. Did you hear the rumor going around school? I mean, come on. A ghost story. You'd think they'd be old enough to know ghosts aren't real. Anyway, uh... I'm feeling kind of uneasy all of a sudden, so I think I'll go to bed early. Sorry. Oh, so I won't be going to Tars today, then. Sorry. That's fine. I didn't plan to go to Tartarus. Um, let me go buy... I think Saturday was when all these sodas, um... Restock. No, I was wrong. Okay. Uh, today is the 30th. We are going to go to the mall. And then... Oh, I don't have enough charm to talk to you yet, Tanaka. 
All right. We're gonna play some video games. We're gonna raise our academics. We're gonna play You're the Answer. I played the quiz game You're the Answer. I learned from my wrong answers and gained new knowledge. Let's go, we got two. Right.